Hi, I'm Jody Lee with DecoPack. In this segment, I like to show you some fondant techniques using an impression mat and some marbleizing. I'm starting off with some, just some white fondant and I colored some blue fondant. And I'm just gonna kind of rope twist this around the white. And there, there really is no real rule of thumb to how you do this. You just kind of work it in work it around until you kind of see some of the blue mixing with the white, like so, like this. Just work it around, don't overwork it. I just want to see where I'm going to have some real striking potential for some marbleizing. And I might be about right here. There, this is looking pretty good. If you got some dark spots, you can always tuck those underneath and just kind of work it around. Have your powdered sugar ready, your rolling pin ready. A little powdered sugar there. And now I'm gonna start rolling it out. Look at that, that's a good one. You don't always get it on the first try. Sometimes it takes a couple tries. Sometimes you just gotta be satisfied with it. But that won't be me. I like a perfect marble, look at that. This would be a nice sky background, nice background for maybe a baby shower. And I'm gonna use an impression mat next, so I don't wanna roll this all the way out to the thickness I will put it on the cake. When I roll it on the impression mat, I'm using real heavy pressure, so I wanna keep this a little more thick. Because once I roll it out on the impression mat, that's gonna be the thickness I'll need to drape it over the cake. In the next segment, I will show you how to transition the marbleized fondant onto an impression mat and onto your cake.